Good morning, everybody. Here is your week ahead tarot readings for the week from the 25th of September for each zodiac sign. My name is Kate May, Modern Day Mystic. You can catch me on katemay.co.uk, on social medias, Kate May, Modern Day Mystic for daily lives. Okay, Aries, a week ahead. Oh, Three of Swords, Aries. This week could be a bit tough for you. It's going to be important that you release anything that is sad, that is hurting you, that is blocking you. Some of you might have blood tests or little mini things that you need to go to uh, the hospital or doctors for a checkup. But in a nutshell, anything that's going to cause some pain or some heartache, this week it's going to be important to let it go and not hold on to it. Taurus, your week ahead. Ten of Swords, oh gosh, the whole week. Ten of Swords, Taurus, this is the end of difficult times. This is karmic endings, karmic changes. You may again feel disappointed or let down by somebody. You could feel that you've been stabbed in the back, perhaps, Taurus. However, this card indicates that that difficult time and period is coming to an end. It's time to close the door, accept what's happened and start a new chapter. Gemini. Hierophant, don't rock the boat. This week, you don't want to do anything that's going to be too outrageous or make too many big changes, Gemini. Keep doing the things that make you feel normal, whatever a routine is for you. Look at groups and organisations. Perhaps spiritual development groups might come in handy this week for you. Following the rules, reg regulations and conforming is going to be super important. Do as you're told this week, Gemini. Okay, Cancer, week ahead. High Priestess, trust your gut feeling, Hans Aarons. Things may not be as they seem to be, but deep down you know what is going on. Again, look for psychic signs, look for symbols, look for little perhaps butterflies or angel numbers, things around you. that. And as I said that, it said 144. Things around you that may let, let you know that the spirit world, those your loved ones are close by. Look at developing your psychic skills. Leo. Happy ever after, Leo. This is a great week. Happy families, enjoying your time, feeling contented, feeling happy and successful. Everything that you've got is coming good for you this week, Leo. Enjoy family time. Virgo, the strength card. You might have to bite your tongue this week, Virgos. You might have to hold it all together. The strength card indicates deal with things in a tactful manner. Don't throw your toys out the pram. Deal with people and situations with love, with gentle handling. And like I said, bite that tongue that you'll remain in the power that way. Libra, magician, manifestation week, Libra. You've got all the tools to do the job. A great week to start new things and to give yourself a boost of confidence. Literally, you can manifest anything you want. You've got everything going for you as above, so below. Libra, this week, your dreams can become a reality, but action is needed. Scorpio, hangman. You could be hanging around this week, Scorpio, dilly-dallying and just waiting for the next thing to happen. Perhaps you've got bigger ideas that need some sacrifices or letting go of the past in order to move forward. There is a bigger picture awakening coming for you, but at the moment this week, Scorpio is just hang on in there and look at things that need releasing, sacrificing in order to move forward. Sagittarius, the Empress. Abundance is your Sagittarius. Growth, nurturing, enjoy the weather, take some time out with your family, spend time in nature. Whatever you put your hand to this week, though, Sagis, you've got a chance for it to grow. You've got abundant wealth coming your way, security, and just feeling comfortable and lovely. Capricorn. It's time to think about your plans. Capricorn, where have you been putting your energy? Where have you been putting your time? Have you been doing what you really wanted to be doing this week is re-evaluating things re-evaluating your time re-evaluating your energy and your money and where you're putting your time and energy thinking about again the bigger picture thinking about what you want longer term but pausing reflecting over how far you've come have the patience something bigger and better is on its way to you capricorn just have some patience aquarius Good news is coming, especially around younger people. You could have some new ideas around making some money or job opportunities. The ground, Aquarius, is super fertile for you. It's ready for action. It's ready for new things. Think about new things, but also action them. Things don't happen unless you start actioning them. But some good ideas some practical ideas are going to come to your mind this week. And Pisces, you're walking away from what no longer serves you. The past is in the past. You're going in a new direction now. You're finding yourself. This is a really positive card, Pisces. You know that you've had to make some changes recently and you should be making them. But it's going to take you onto a wonderful new path where you're really going to find yourself. And some spiritual enlightenment is coming. What no longer serves you, you're walking away from and you're going into the light. Have a great week, everyone.